It is Sunday evening. It's our last night in Key West. We have to check out at 11 in the morning. And uh, we've cleaned up a lot, but we still have a lot of crap laying around. Yeah. Not that you know, you don't want to see what the bedroom looks like because it's it's a mess also. But we'll get it cleaned up, get out of here, head back. Um, it's a two-day trip because with the truck and the trailer RV, you have to drive so slow. So little Peta is in for the night. Oh, oh can you see her? Oh, there she is. Hey, Peta. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. So, got the good news on Friday that my echocardiogram was normal, and so the cardiologist's office is going to fax a security, security, <laughs> that'd be nice, surgery clearance to my orthopedist, orthopedic surgeon, so that I can get my right rotator cuff surgery rescheduled. So tomorrow, once we're on the road, I'm going to try to call, see if I can't get that accomplished. Um, this just throws my whole plan for the summer off because if everything had gone the way it was supposed to, I would be two weeks into recovery right now. Um, I would be struggling around without my right arm, but I would be that much closer to um, physical therapy and being able to use my arm so now here we are but I guess everything happens for a reason so it's good to know that my heart is okay I I mean it's okay um I've inherited my father's cholesterol issues and um I gotta get myself into shape because I'm not in shape um, I'm just not in shape so anyway that's what I got to work on. Um, so, I may or may not be um, posting stuff. Yeah, I will. I'll be bored in the truck. I'll be posting stuff <laughs> on Facebook tomorrow. So, um, wish us well on our trip home. Hopefully, it's uneventful. We get home okay. Um, we don't bite each other's heads off too much. Um, and we are missing Kim Powell already. We took her to the airport a while ago. And and Pete is missing her too. Pete said, where is that nice lady that let me sit in her lap? All right, y'all. Have a great evening. We'll see you later. I'll keep you updated on the surgery because I know you're just waiting with bated breath on the next adventure with my shoulder. Peace out, y'all.